zero. The back's quite sharp, but in fact, I don't really like the way the back's going to look in at the moment. So it's going to select all these. I know it's not following the reference 100%, but I'd rather have a gun that looks good than be accurate, really. I mean, it's going to look a bit stupid if it's going to be in game and it's just really sharp on his hand. Oh crap. So I'd rather make my own little unique changes to it. It's not like anyone will notice anyway. It's a game for God's sake. <laughs> it's not this isn't even gonna be using a mod anyway, it's just an example of how to model. And we're gonna be putting it in Half Life 2 when the SDK comes out, but that's about it really. And I'm just looking around my gun to see if everything's alright. The back looks a tiny little bit too thin. But that part looks a bit bulky, I don't know why that is. I mean it might be because it's got more in the area. It's actually looking quite nice. Right, I'm just gonna come back here and come back to my reference images to find out how the back I think the back just smooths round at the back, doesn't it? So um push this up a bit. Push that up a bit. Grab that, pull it back. Put it down. What I'm going to do here is just come to this viewport. And select that. Pull it all the way back. Same with this one as well. And I'm just going to select these. Connect. Weld that down because I don't need it and try and add a, like, a smooth area to the back. Uh, it's not looking too good. I'm just trying to minimise the amount of polygons that go into this section. In fact, I could even just weld that on there. It's kind of smooth. It's alright. I'm just going to drag these out. Target weld. I've actually passed the 40 minute mark now, hence why I'm trying to hurry this up. Right, that's looking alright, I'm just going to select this and just bring it back a bit. In fact I'll just, I can put this back where it was before. Just put a minus thing because I missed it out. minor little changes to have it flow up into it. Um, in fact I'll just get rid of that, I don't even need it. Oh, sorry. To make sure it make sure it knows what it's doing. There we go. That's looking alright. Just select my whole model and do the same as I did before just to make sure I've got no loose verts around. Looks alright. Um what else we need to do the front here? I think that's mainly going to be done in the tutorial where we do this top part. Yeah, I'll leave that for that part. Um, that's all right. The back can be done. Yeah, the, you pull the whole top back, so that's all right. And the magazine, yeah. I think that's just about going to conclude this. I've just managed to keep it under 42 minutes. Probably add some little things in later on, but. Anyway, see you later. I hope this has been helpful.